Lewis, David McGoldrick scored a hat-trick last weekend and the manager told us you were the best player on the pitch. That is some praise, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's nice to hear from your manager, but I think you score a hat-trick, you obviously done something in the game. So I'm going to give that one to Didzi still, to be fair. So, What is he like to play with? Oh, he's, he's a Rolls-Royce of a player, really. He sees things that not many other players on the pitch see. And obviously, I think me and him have a good connection when we play together. So, yeah, it's really good and I'm thriving off him. What's he like on the training pitch with you? Is, is he teaching you things? Is he explaining how, how he plays a bit at all? Yeah, it's from the day I arrived here, he's had his arm around me and he's taught me a lot of things and told me how I should do different things. And obviously, I'm trying to add more to my game, so hopefully it's showing on the pitch and I can keep listening to him. Let's talk about where, where your game is at at the moment. How do you feel about how things are going here? Yeah, I feel good. I think the last month or so I've been a bit better, but I still think there's a long way to go and I'm still trying to improve a lot of things in my game and hopefully I can keep getting better and better. Has something changed in particular? Are you doing something differently? or? No, I think the main thing is just self-belief, like confidence, being, believing in my ability, because at the end of the day, only I know what I'm really capable of, and I've just got to keep convincing myself of that. I was going through the, the stats the other day. You've been involved in every game except one since you arrived on loan at the start of the season. Are you happy with, with how involved you've been? Yeah, I think when I'm not playing or when I am playing, I think my attitude stays the same. I'm, I'm eager to prove myself. I'm hungry to prove myself, and hopefully... And keep doing that. It, yeah, I, I guess not playing is sort of part of the process of, of, of learning how to be a professional player, isn't it? Yeah, I think as soon as the new gaffer came in, we had that conversation. He says, you can't expect to play every minute of every game. And obviously, I don't expect to do that. But when I do, I'm going to give it my all and hopefully impress. A question I always ask loan players is, is, is how much of the, the parent club, how much are Everton, in, in your case, keeping in touch with you? Yeah, it's weekly to be fair. They have a loan manager called James Vaughan. So he's always in contact with me and he comes to Derby sometimes to go for food. And we always talk about my progress and what I can keep doing. And obviously he gives me goals that I can hopefully achieve. Talking to Hayden Roberts about this last week and he was saying he sort of feels as though while he's here, you know, he's a Derby player rather than a Brighton player. Do you sort of feel the same way? Yeah, of course. Say Derby is definitely my main focus right now, and obviously I want to do well with the club and keep thriving and keep getting the rewards. Uh, the boss has been named manager of the month for for January, um, which he's downplayed as, as as we expect from him. But but it is an award for all of you, isn't it? Yeah, hundred percent. But I wouldn't say he's downplayed it. To be fair, I mean, <laughs> oh really? We had a team meeting this morning. We walked into music, and then he got it out. To be fair, so. But no, nah, it's definitely a team thing. I think we can all take credit to it and uh, yeah, we've all earned it. You're on a terrific run of, of form. Can, can you sort of explain what is going so well for, for the side right now? Um, i say just the overall morale of the team. I think everyone's really close and I think it's a real family feel in the team at the minute. And I think we're just really positive and confident in ourselves and it's thrown on the pitch. And the only game that, that you missed was, was Wickham at home. You faced them on, on Saturday. What's been said about them so far? Yeah, they're a very direct team, obviously. Um, they're good at home, but I think there's nothing we haven't faced already and I'm going into the game full of confidence and hopefully you can get the three points. Yeah, I guess when, when you're on the winning streak that you are, you're going to feel confident whoever you face, right? Yeah, 100%. I think we've just got to keep going step by step, game by game, and uh, hopefully we keep getting the results.